You have five seconds to guess what's in this box. Here's a hint. Well, guys, if you have guessed Bama Performance from American Muscle, you were correct. But, what I got... Ooh, look at that. Focus. Wow, they customized... They put Custom Tomb by Bama Performance. Put my name... And then my 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 Mustang. Ooh. But yes, I bought a uh Mustang Bank for Eliminator chip. So this should actually make my car faster, not you know adding a cold air intake and all that other dumb stuff to oh give me a horsepower. This is pretty much two tunes, which I put 91 for my performance. And 93 for my, my race mode, which I'm probably going to be on 93 for a while. So, uh, tomorrow, because I have no tools tonight and I still got to run the Harbor Freight. Get some more tools for work, you know, you know how that goes. But uh, this will be installed tomorrow, so I will see you in one second. Alright guys, right here is my ECU, which I got really carried away, and I should have showed you guys. What I did to take this out, but I was very impatient. Here is the chip I will be putting in the ECU. So, pretty much, you take these 5.5 millimeter screws out. And then, obviously, you take this top off. And then, you would take the middle, move the base out of the way, obviously, flip it over. And I believe what they're trying to say is you need to clean. You need to clean this part up of all that glue residue. And then I believe it just goes in just like that. Yeah, just like that. So this one takes a while to actually clean up. They even give you this little scotch bright that you can use to scrape it. But don't go too far, obviously, because then you'll mess with the ECU. So I'm going to sit here and try to get all this glue off, which I... Hopefully can. It looks pretty, pretty, like, there's a lot of it. So what I'm going to do is probably get a little toothpick and start cleaning all of this up. Alright, well, I just installed it. Hopefully I put it in right. Well, no, at the end of this video, because it won't start. Why does it look like that? Is it supposed to look like that? Did I put it in wrong? See, this is what I, I don't understand. Okay. I'm going to put the camera down. Uh, if that was right, I'll put the case back on, obviously, all four, six, actually, six. And put the cable in the car next, even though it's dark outside. But uh, we can get some lighting. All right, well, that's it. Uh, what they're recommending is putting tape from, like, right here. Well, not that, but uh, two inches wide to at least cover up the chip. And then obviously just wrap it all the way around like that, which I sound that sounds really good. They should just supply you with something like this. This is the original that came off of it. All right. Yeah, they should really supply you with that. But now I need to hook up this and run that in the car and make sure this guy is set to zero, which it's hard to see. Really hard to see. The camera won't even focus for it. So I need to figure out this guy. So. Hopefully, the next thing you see is this in the car, and the car starts with no problems, right? Yeah. Well, it's a little chilly out, and uh, that is what I did. I put cardboard right here to pretty much protect the duct tape from actually touching that. Now, what I'm going to do is plug it back in. Hopefully, she starts, and she idles great, you know. Um, I have a 91 and a 93 octane tune. Uh, my tank is pretty much empty, which is awesome, and it's starting to get really cold, and I only have fucking shorts and a t-shirt on, so I'm going to go ahead and start this. I am not going to film, obviously. It's too, way too cold. Alright, sorry for the low light. EC is plugged in. I really wish you could see. I'm sure in the light. This is turned to zero, and uh, I'm pretty nervous, and... Uh, Alright, everything just reset. 
Oh, that's, that's weird. See that? Dot, dot, dot. See, it's got dash, dash, dash. Alright, here we go. Oh, my God. Woo! That thing's red. Oh, come on. Do I have to do something there? Oh, the theft, what? Why is the theft light on? All right, hold on, let's try this again. Why would the theft light be on or something? Oh, there's a ground to the ECU. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure there's a ground to the ECU that I totally forgot to hook up. So, we're going to have to go back and do that. Alright. Round number. Theft light's still on. Come on. It's giving me nothing. Let's go back to zero. That's on zero. Why is it saying theft? Stop saying theft. If you're reading theft, then fucking what would it be? Alright, gonna retry this again. Alright, so I plugged it in a little harder and I got mileage back and the theft light's not on. Oh boy! Oh, I didn't start. That is on zero. Flip it the one. Oh, it killed it. Oh, come on. Oh, it went back to fucking zero. Come on, give me my mileage back. Alright, got my mileage back. <sighs> Alright, hold on. I gotta do some research. Alright, the car's on. It's idling rough because A, I still have 87. So, we're gonna hopefully drive. It's working with throttle. Hopefully, hopefully. Are we going to get gas? We have to get gas right now. Okay, oh, yeah, I figured that's the first thing we would do is head towards gas. What time I don't want to romp on it. Oh my god. It's like 7.30. Okay. Well, not one will be the closest. Yeah, that's the one I'm going to. Do I have my card? Yep. Yeah, the card acting kind of fine. Hopefully with the new gas. I'm, I'm just going to run 91 for now. Hopefully. Hopefully. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh god. Don't die on me, car. We'll get you some gas. Just act fine for now. If that light turns red, you just blow it. Oh god, this car's acting funny. Oh, you're cold. Look at what I'm wearing. Alright. Huh? Did you open the front door? I forget. Alright, the mock's warmed up. Alright. Shit, I locked the. Oh god! Oh! Oh, come on! Come on! Oh god, it got cold! Got this, boys. All right. So today's video Ooh. is obviously gonna be racing this Mustang versus the Mach One again. We're at a stop. All right. All right. Here we go.